Am I right in thinking that you've come across each other before the Lions tour, but the Lions tour was a sort of a, a defining watershed? Has do you want to go first? I think you know you can't <clears> play rugby, rugby and not know not know Johnny. The team that I found most difficult to ever play against was was Ireland. Uh, you know, especially away at the Aviva, and you know Johnny's kind of been the, the number one man there for for a long time. And I'll probably come on to this a little bit later, but you know some of the quotes, say for example, what Brian Driscoll said about him and everything else is that he you know he's a fierce competitor and dry, you know likes to drive standards, you know, and will push people in his team and gets quite excited so when you play against him because he's so competitive it'll get into your get into your face a little bit so I, so I I only ever spoken to him off the field and you also get those two different versions where you sort of get the guy that's quite quiet off the field and then you kind of get the the, the loud player so I'd come across him and I, I didn't think we were going to get on I just thought you know he couldn't we couldn't have been any different I'm a loud gobby but he's a student studied student of the game he's talented for one I you know, I, he's got all the skills. I used to just hit people for a living. It was basically, I think, one of our encounters we had was the last time we played Wasp versus Leinster. And I, and I apologise for my language on this. We always smile because Johnny still reminds me of it. I'd given a penalty where I got done for a penalty. It's my, it's my nickname. Did, <laughs> Johnny, is his nickname. Johnny, My nickname Johnny came, for you now is that, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> and Johnny came running in, standard, like running in from like 30 feet. And we'd obviously played loads of internationals against each other, but I probably hadn't been for a beer with him or been for a coffee with him. Modern rugby now is very much like wham, bam, thank you, man. You play, you shake hands, you have a couple of words, and then you disappear. So I've given a penalty away. Johnny's come running in. Ah, oh, fucking ass, good at that. I got up. I was like, fuck off, sex, and you shit. And everyone's like, but Johnny's like face is just a bit like, what? I don't think he's ever, <laughs> ever been called that. So much so that like Nigel Owens was standing right next to me and he's gone, James, James, go over here. And he's like, takes one side and goes, mate, we can't have language like that on the rugby field. I've never heard any like it. Shit. What is that? All right. And I said, well, sorry, actually, my, my, my mum taught me that. My, my, you know, she would, I don't think she did, right? We then obviously... Um, Carried on, the, carried on the game, Leinster beat us. And then obviously when we got on the Lions tour and started to, to get on and go for coffees and realise we were sort of like kindred spirits, loved the Sappuccino. But Johnny, every now and then I get a, an Instagram message which just says, all right, shit, <laughs> like, cheers, pal. It's Haskey in your book as... Um, in my black book. In your, well, in your, I don't know, your black book, your phone book, I don't know. He's in a few kill lists as well. I mean, your, your first impressions of Hask? Hey, well, they were my first impressions, uh, him calling me that. So it didn't get off to, on a good note. I played, obviously, with Ben Teo for a season in Leinster. Um, got on really well with him. And when we got picked on the lines together, Ben was uh, telling me how well I get on with Hask. And I was like, oh, I don't know. He, he had a bit of a run in the Wasps game. But the first thing we did when we, we met up for a coffee and I spent my whole time laughing at him. Uh, he's once he gets going he's, he's great entertainment and uh, yeah we, we had some great great times in that Lions tour many that we won't be able to discuss on this uh, <laughs> forum uh, but we will we will remember them forever I think 